The Franco-Prussian War How and why the conflict started the conflict started when the North German Federation, ruled by Prussia, with the Chancellor being Otto von Bismarck, wanted to extend unity with the Southern German Federation. Otto was going to do this by starting a French dispute. He thought attacking would, ho would hopefully bring the two countries together. He did this by talking about the succession of the Spanish throne, by saying that King, King William of Prussia and the French minister, which made France feel like they were being insulted. The French then demanded war with Prussia while Napoleon, saying that he knew they were going to win. On July 16, 1870, the French Parliament declared war on the German Kingdom of Prussia. The German released their troops sooner, but the French troops were more advanced and trained. After the siege of Metz and the Battle of Sedan, and many other attacks, the French were defeated and Napoleon was captured. Then, on July 28, 1871, the French capital fell, which then led to an uprising called the, Fran the Paris Commune. Prussia controlled the capital for two months. Um, it was then taken back by France in May 1871. The German states were then, un were then united and were named the German Empire, which being led by King William I. The unification of Germany dis disturbed the European balance of power and the Congress of Vienna. The two main countries that were involved were the German Federation and Prussia. What were the results? Um, Thiers was named chief of the executive power in France and provision was made for the election of a French National Assembly. They met at war decks. March 1st, the preliminary peace agreement, which was formalized in the Treaty of Frankfurt. It was ratified May 21st, 1871. Uh, they had to pay an indemnity of one billion within three years. Paris refused to disarm and submit to the Thiers regime, and the Commune of Paris was formed. Troops loyal to Thiers began the second siege of Paris, April to May of 1871. After the suppression of the commune, the peace was returned to France. The Franco-Prussian War had other far-reaching efforts, such as uh, the desire for revenge guided the French policy for the following half century, and the Prussian militarism had triumphed and led the groundwork for German imperialistic ventures. These events later caused the chain reaction leading to the uprise of World War I. Some interesting facts were that the total amount of people killed was 872,981. Um, it lasted from July 19th, 1870 to May 10th, 1871, which lasted less than a year. Um, Seraphin Provost was the last French veteran who died in 1955, and Karl Glockner was the last German veteran who died in 1953.